What is up everyone? I hope you're all good. I am back again. Uh weren't expecting it, I weren't expecting to do another video. I was in the past few days. I'm still on polls, but obviously there's certain things I'm like, oh I've got to, got to put this out in the video or I've got to sort of respond to that or I've got to do this. Got to do that. BAM! First I hope you're all doing okay because as you can tell I'm at a bit of a distance. The reason is this, I am doing, not un not unboxing, but unbooking. Uh, maybe, obviously, <clears throat> I'm starting to the point now where it's, yeah, this is a new, this is a gaming channel, but I've got to put now where, fuck it. I want to also talk about shit I am nerdy about and passionate about, and this is one of them. Um. I recently started, was in the last couple of months, was the book wise, I've got a big in story books, which I've led the past since I say late July, early August, has got in conversation with a mate of mine about books, and he, he knows I'm a big Kevin Smith fan. And uh, he, I mean, one day he was in. As I don't know, he sort of looked through Amazon and he sort of um, ran at Kevin Smith and saw a book that was on uh, pre-order. And uh, he sort of showed me, do uh, you know anything about that? I went, no. And uh, <laughs> we were discussing it and he sort of said, I said to him, like, can you pre-order it for me? Can you, uh, I was like, oh, you pre-order it, I'll give you the money back. Um, it did. Um, it turns up as we last we do it before, but it was due to conflicts between work. It was truly our time and time for me to pick it up. But uh, today, as of, as of the day of recording, I picked it up, and I say it's a book. It's more like it's a it's like a Bible. And here it is. It is the Kevin Smith, Secret Stash, The Definitive Visual History. Um, this is... This weren't, we weren't cheap. Um, it was 30... After the Amazon discount, Amazon Prime discount he used, it was 30 quid. Um, I think without the discount, it's about a 36, 37 pound book. American, it's, this is on the back, 65, and, um, and poor, poor old Canada, it's, it's fucking 85. Uh, but, I kind of went through this quickly, or I'll say quickly, this afternoon with him, and it's, it took me an hour to sort of skim through it, sort of thing. But, it's you sort of you think oh it's very quick of a book. It's firstly for me it being Kevin Smith is worth it, but also the quality of the book itself. Actually, to be fair, what you get inside it's it's something that it does you think a lot. It was nice little touches. Um, because in the book itself, he does basically starts off from a pretty correct. Actually, what I'm gonna do so does it irritate me while showing you? Quick, let's stick cover off. But it's basically apart from having the name, it basically the same. Um, but it starts off pretty much from clerks. Um, clerks. Obviously, there's a foreword by. Obviously, if you know Kevin Smith, you know who is he. He's a his hetero life mate, Jay Muse. Basically, done a big spill at the front, talking about Kevin, and you you see that um, in the book every now and then. There's certain things he's worked with that that speak about him. But yeah, obviously, so it starts with him pretty much day one. Um, 
I can still sort of thing. Um, yes, I sort of uh, pitched up when I was younger. I was eating it as long as I can. But it's some of the things they added now, which, haha, straight away. It's, was he went to Vancouver Film School. Um, is this. And what, one of the things he actually put in the book is instead of printing it on the normal paper like he would everything else, he fundamentally gives you copies. So, as if I show you, that's the normal page, but that are copies of his student profile. From film school. Um, I wish I had a part of it. Partly we had a better setup so I can show you a bit more in depth. Um, like clerks. Um, or if you've seen clerks, you sort of know these sort of um, being a bit weird. But, um, not that I don't know much I can remember. Well, we're running around, aren't they? Basically, the opening scene is basically part of the script from that. Talking about that sort of scene, opening scene. Um, but again, it's these sort of small things you get in it. But it, it obviously goes through in depth about things like uh, clerks. Um, even, even up to like his fucking podcasting day, his podcast, his toilet bookshop, he's a, uh, um, the secret stash, um, it, basically, if, if you want, I'm to, actually, I actually missed that first time around, so, you look, so, A few askew cards, or business cards, but it's, it's it's basically if you are a Kevin Smith fan, this is basically a bible that goes into more rats. That's what I mean. It's when I, when I picked it up, I was, was classing it as my bible. Um, let's give a few pages. It's, it's so much here. It's, it's a chasing Amy. It's like um, a Who is Tim Smith by Ben Affleck. Um, he got bit by people to talk about his um, about his career. Or did it copies of like newspaper articles. Um, There's certain small things I actually quite like. So one of them was, was he quite a bit red. Or if you've seen the films, you know, uh, in the universe is basically the Black Man Chronic um, comic book. They gave me basically one of the pages from that. Apologies, Aussie. You might not be able to see it clearly because I'm, I am at a distance. Um, I will sort of put some stuff on that on Instagram. Obviously, in Chasing Amy, yes, film. But part of the comic book they're showing with the Chasing Amy comic book at the end of the film is also in there. Um, even like in the Criminals from the Universe. As of a few years ago, it was, it was sort of fictional, but they actually brought it to a life. A restaurant called a fast food place with movies. In this, you get a a I don't want to get this out, but it's basically a movies hashhead 
basically a movies hash brown holder. Um, so you can see even things like that they've sort of thought they thought about to uh, insert in the book. Um, even like a letter from a fan sort of thing they've inserted. Um, And that's it. It's, it's for anyone, Kevin Smith, who enjoys Kevin Smith as a director. Um, benefit inside. It's this is going to be. One of the things that I think people regret, like the old fucking clip commander, it's one of the but then it's it's like I said, it's there's a lot here, and that's. Really, the tip of the iPad is so. This, I can go for for ages talking about things, and uh, basically talking about the book itself. It's for me. Um, for me, as a, a bit of dust sleeve on. I forget for thirty quid. As a much of a massive Kevin Smith fan I am, it's thirty pounds well spent. It, and I think that's what people. I think. As when you collect things, especially things you're passionate about, things like this that put a lot of effort into that you enjoy watching slash reading, these are things that are sort of um are worth looking at. But yeah, that's so that is basically an unbooking. Sorry about this sort of setup. It's sort of wish I had a better setup to sort of show you, but. I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, I hope you enjoyed looking at the book as much as I enjoy spending the next trillion years enjoying it. Um, and I hope to speak to you guys very soon. Ciao for now.